right, it has arrived. I found a collector on a Facebook group. And with this Facebook group, I found some really interesting Tomicas, of which I've paid almost uh, $200 for. So let's have a look at what's arrived. Let's have a look here. All right, so here we go. LBC Delivery Express from Manila. The suspense is killing me. It's either going to be really good or really bad. So I paid a bit for these. Quite a substantial amount actually. Now let me go ahead, fast forward me opening this. And this is what I'm talking about. So this is what I bought. I bought two F-Series, the F-28, the F-48, and nine black boxes. So really cool. I don't have any of the black boxes, nor do I have any of the F-Series. So I was really happy to find this online. Very so let's cool. Let's go ahead and just open a couple of these now. And I'll just show you what they look like. Obviously, I'm checking to see, you know, is this the real deal? Indeed, it does look legitimate. These that I'm going to open now and just do a little bit of a check on. See that uh, they are the same as what I've been sold online. It's always a risk when buying online. So that's what it looks like fresh out of the plastic. Actually, the boxes are in pretty good condition. Number 58, this one you can see on the back. Tommy number 58. Stick to kind of open up in a good way. There we go. Let's see what it looks like. Hey, oh, it's still in the plastic. Still in the plastic, everybody. So there we go, this is the 240Z. It's a bit dirty under the uh, undercarriage, but it's pretty old. Wow. That is unreal, look at that. That is just so retro. Oh my God, that's cool. Wow, Tomica. Have a date? I'm trying to see if it has a date. Yeah, it does. It says 1975. See that there? 1975. Very, very cool. Nissan Fairlady 240ZG. Wow. Oh, man. I think this is my all time favorite car now in my collection. Number one. Oh, the paint on that, it's like a purpley blue. Just throw that on top there. Wow, look at that. That is epic. So the next one we're unboxing, uh, I believe it is another 240Z and it's a police car. It's also my lucky number, number 44. You can see that there, number 44. So let's open this up. Next one, just opening it now. My lucky number, number 44. Some of the boxes have been trimmed off there, you can see, which is not too good, but it's a nice looking box. Nice image, that. Let's pull this one out. Again, fresh in the plastic. Fresh in the plastic bag. Oh my God, these are in mint. Mint, I mean mint condition. Wow. Absolute mint. I sure like the lights on the other one. There's no real plastic there. It's like the, the Datsun police car. Datto. 
Imagine Batman or someone driving this. It's very cool. That's a police car. Let's go ahead and open the next one, number 32. I think that to me looks like, is it a bluebird? Not too sure, the 32, not too sure. I'll, I'll probably know more when I open her up. This is the next one I'm opening up, number 32. Honestly, the condition's so good, I'm a little bit skeptical as to whether they're new or, you know, reprints. Oh, that is nice. Look at that paint. It's a crown. Look at that paint. Beautiful. They do look like reprints to me, but either way, I mean, black boxes, very hard to come by. Especially where I am. That blue with the white interior just sets it off. Alright, so I've got these F series as well. I'm going to save the best for last. I love these two F series. I'm just going to save these two F series just for last. But let's go ahead and open the others. Did it come? It did, mate. It's here. So the next, I have two of these duplicates. He did have a couple and I bought both of them is the fire chief so let's open this up be careful here got two of these this is a fire chief so let's open this up just careful careful Gotta be careful with these so, oh wow that looks like it has so that looks like it has like a piece on top I don't want to lose that. Oh no, I think that's supposed to be on the top of the car there. It's also got a couple of stickers. I'm not going to put them on. Toyota Crown Fire Chief. Does it have a date? No date there. So it's probably from the 70s or 80s. Either way, very, very cool. Fire Chief. Let's go. It's like something out of a TV show, really. Very retro, that. Very cool. Opening this one next, number six, which is another duplicate. Looks like another uh, fair lady. So I have a few fair ladies here today. Uh, most of which, half of the models I've got are fair ladies. This is the box. See that? see the car on the back very cool boxes let's open her up again in plastic they're really good condition the boxes and the cars all of them just opening them all up just wanting to check them all yep so another fair lady z i can't find you know, for some reason, it's got the scale there, 1 to 60, but I can't find the date of manufacture, which is a bit strange to me. That's a beautiful colour, though. I love the blue with the lights. I think the blue, you know, with the lights are really cool. But, I mean, this is how they, they came. This is how they were made, originally, in the 1970s and 80s. Very cool. Comparing the two Datsuns here, I mean, the blue is a lot bigger. I think it was, you know, 1 to 60 as well, whereas this is also 1 to 60, but it was longer. Like, it is, is a bit longer. If I push it forward there a tad, you know, for example, it's not that much longer, I guess. A different shape, indeed. This looks unreal. This is the 2000 GT, the Nissan. At the time, I think it was actually a Prince. It was a 2000 GT Prince, uh, which is the old name for Nissan. Scale is 1 to 62, so let's open this up. This I'm excited to see. I'm really excited to see this. Let's have a look. That's so cool. 
Skyline HT Racing. Let's get the bottom. Tomica. Rad. Very nice. There is a little bit of a dent, a little bit of a dent at the front there. It's a bit of a shame, but otherwise it's almost flawless. The two door here, my God. Just have a look at that for a second. I mean, that is hot. That is cool, really, really cool. Front lights, which on the side. You can see there's nice curves there. From the back. It even says GT. It's a fair weight and the doors do open. White interior. <laughs> that is unreal. That's my favorite thus far. That is just wow. Wow, wow, wow. So the next one you can see here, and I'm not going to pull out the duplicates. There are nine black boxes, but two of which are duplicates. So this is the last of the black boxes. This looks like a Subaru. And the scale is 1 to 50. So it's strange to me how the scale is different on a lot of these cars. Like the Fire Chief, for example, is 1 to 65. This is 1 to 50, and the others are like 1 to 60, mostly. Again, mint condition. Really nice. Let's have a look at this. Look at that green. It's got a bit of a bubble in the paint there. Wow, does that open? It does. Look at that, it opens. <laughs> Keep the bonnet closed. You can see just under the undercarriage there straight away, Tomica. Subaru, yes, the Subaru 360. Very nice. Let's have a look at that. The black top. Beep, beep. <laughs> so that's the set, everybody. That is what I got. That is the black boxes. Okay, so let's have a better look. That's it, that's the black boxes. Got two duplicates, looking really nice. There's some great colors there. I think my favorite are the uh, GDR, the 2000 GT, and the blue 240 Fair Lady Z. So yeah, really, really nice. I'm very happy with my purchase. Uh, my wallet's hurting, <laughs> so I do need your support, guys. Stay tuned though, stay tuned. Because in the next video, I am going to open up these two F-Series. Look at that. Look at the artwork on it. It's absolutely stunning. So yeah, on the next uh, videos, I will be opening these two F-Series, both made in Japan. Thanks for watching. This is Thank you so much for watching. This is one of my first videos as a collector of Tomica and this is the collectors club so welcome to the collectors club and thanks for watching please do share like and subscribe and stay tuned for those two f series stay tuned beautiful wifey is helping me to pack them which is so sweet say hello arian hi hey and arian also has her own youtube channel you can search her by searching Aryan Freer on YouTube.